Chapter 55 Benny the Brave Bear With the enchanting world of Everbright once again bathed in the warm embrace of dreams, Prince Leo, Princess Amelia, Drizzle, and their friends eagerly awaited their next adventure. Little did they know that their journey would introduce them to a new friend with a heart as big as the kingdom itself. One sunny afternoon, as they explored the outskirts of the kingdom, they heard a faint cry for help. Following the sound, they discovered a magical glade where the trees whispered ancient secrets. In the center of the glade stood Benny the Brave Bear. Benny was not like any ordinary bear. He possessed a unique gift. His touch could mend anything broken. With a warm heart and a gentle paw, he had mended countless items for the enchanted creatures of the forest. But now, Benny had a problem of his own. His most cherished possession, his magical mending amulet, was shattered into a hundred shimmering pieces, each reflecting a different color of the rainbow. The group approached the bear, eager to help. We'll find those pieces for you, Benny, Prince Leo promised. The bear's eyes filled with gratitude, and he shared with them the magic words that would mend his amulet, mend to blend. The quest began as they searched the enchanted world far and wide. Each piece of the amulet had its own distinct challenge. They found one hidden in the heart of a crystal cave, another soaring high in the clouds, and a third nestled deep within a magical rose garden. Through teamwork, laughter and shared determination, they retrieved all the missing amulet pieces. Returning to Benny the brave bear, they placed the pieces before him. Following the bear's magic words, they watched in awe as the amulet reformed, radiant and complete. Benny, the brave bear's eyes welled with tears of joy as he thanked his new friends. To show his appreciation, he used the amulet's magic to mend a broken bridge allowing them access to a hidden corner of the enchanted world. The hidden corner revealed an astounding secret, a meadow filled with dancing fireflies and enchanted flowers that could sing. Benny had shared his unique gift with the world, and in return, the world had given him a place of beauty and wonder. With a deep sense of fulfillment, Benny knew that he would continue mending whatever he could for the joy was not in the magic itself, but in the act of helping others. As they left the magical meadow behind, Benny joined their group, eager to be a part of their adventures. Together, they embraced the new day, ready to continue their journey, knowing that with each challenge they overcame, the enchanted world grew richer and more wondrous. As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting the kingdom in a gentle golden glow. The group of friends ventured into the heart of Everbright, ready to face whatever magical mysteries lay ahead. To be continued. Thanks a bunch for sharing this adventure with us. We had a blast and we hope you did too. Remember to give that like button a friendly tap and hit the subscribe button so you won't miss out on more fantastic tales and giggles. Can't wait to see you again soon for another round of storytime fun.